Move it out, Shiv. Oh, oh yeah. Hero, huh? Identifying prisoner 117, Shiv Helix. You think you can break me, copper? Yeah, I've been in the darkest pits in the universe. Places that would make your vaults rattle. The eternity pits of sword doom. The iron holding no balance. <laughs> Greetings, new fish. I'm... Captain Quark. I... I don't believe it. You're here. I used to dream of being arrested by you. Now get out of here. I was talking to you, Zed. Yes, Captain. So, new fish, I take it you followed my many, many adventures? Of course I have. You're the most famous superhero in the galaxy. He ain't famous anymore. <laughs> Words hurt, solitary Bill. I'm a huge fan. I even pre-ordered the new Ratchet & Clank Hollow game. The what? You know, the game based on that incident with you and that Lombax. Oh, you must mean the Hollow film. Yeah, it's pretty good. If you like all CG. No, I mean the game. It's based on the Hollow film. Look, here's my confirmation email. I'm having it mag shipped to prison. <laughs> They're making a game based on the Hollow film based on my life? But they haven't even consulted me. Oh, this is my fault. I've been away from my adoring public in this forsaken place too long. And now, no one will ever hear my side. I'd like to hear your side, Captain. You would? Well, then sit down, wary criminal, and I'll tell you a story. It all started with a hapless Lombax named Ratchet. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Hey, Grim, you're here. I I thought you'd be down at the bazaar shopping for gravity coils. Uh huh. Well, I'm here. I'm always here. I don't suppose you sneaking out would have anything to do with those Galactic Ranger tryouts? I just need one hour. Come on, Grim. These are the Galactic Rangers we're talking about. Captain Quark will be there. No leaving the garage until you help fix Mr. Micron's ship. Now get on that bolt crank. Does that ship look mag-lifted to you? Get on that bolt crank, come on! Come on, give it a spin. Okay, let's see if these new Versa bulbs work. Look up, do you see something flashing? Yep, left side looks good. It's a miracle. On to the afterburner lights. Look down. You see something? Lower left afterburner light checks out. This thing might just be space-worthy after all. One more to the right. Lower right afterburner works. So, are we good? Yep, we're good. The news says the tryouts are being held at the fairgrounds. Show them what you got, kid. And so Ratchet began his adventure, hoping to become a galactic ranger.
Ratchet bashed his enemies using his trusty Omni Wrench. Nice. In order to best his foes, Ratchet used the warrior's time-honored tradition of jumping. Ratchet knew he faced mortal peril. Should he find himself on the verge of death, he'd need to find nanotech to heal. <laughs> I used that stuff after a bank robbery once. It healed like three out of five gunshot wounds. <laughs> displayed a flagrant disregard for public property. Look at him, smashing crates. <laughs> the hubris. Maybe he was just saving up vaults so he could buy a new weapon to protect the galaxy with. Hey, who's telling the story? Galaxy is a perilous place, as evidenced by the large amounts of ammunition left sitting around in crates. <laughs> if you see me at the event, please do 
not run up and insist on shaking hands. My mighty Christ-like grip has been known to shake the confidence of even the most heroic of men. And I would hate to throw you off your game. to spice things up, we've armed these dummies with Gadgetron flamethrowers. Our lawyers are totally cool. <laughs> like some angry toads. Impressive. Could we be looking at Solana's next Galactic Ranger? Wasn't so bad. Ladies and gentlemen, the savior of Solana, Captain Quark. Hello, Veldin. Hello, Captain. He's on fire again. I know. My name is Copernicus Quark, and yes, that was an impressive wall of fire I just walked past. I'm gonna be real with you folks for a moment. When President Vironix recommended I take on a new ranger, I knew just where to go. That's right. We want you! Yeah! I know what you're thinking. Do I have what it takes? After all, you may not have prevented Dr. Nefarious from atomizing Illyro City. You may not have stopped Neptune Prague from rendering the entire population of Aridia colorblind... twice. After all, you may not have this chiseled jaw or godlike pectoral region, but if you have heart, then you have what it takes. You don't have what it takes. But... I have heart. Yes, but unfortunately that heart is encased in a weak, muscleless mass of inexperience. Plus, there's your history to consider. Got a long line of citations here. Possession of an illegal gravity repulsor. Operation of a black market accelerator. Willful disruption of the space-time continuum? <laughs> that is a funny story. You're reckless. You're a loose cannon, and you're dangerous. That's my shtick. Wait, go... Just give me a chance. All right, no time. Galaxy in jeopardy. Get back out there. And remember, you can do anything. As long as you're me. Next! Meanwhile, on planet Quartu... Dr. Nefarious, the mad scientist who made all of this possible. Mad suggests cognitive impairment. I'm more of a vengeful scientist. I trust you're here to meet the troops. Hmm. <laughs> 